All right, welcome back guys. Today we're gonna be doing a brand new HTML series. And hopefully I'm gonna go over everything to do with HTML. So let's go and get started. So what is HTML or what does it stand for? It stands for Hypertext Markup Language. Now, what does that mean? It essentially means, uh, it, or it's essentially used to power web pages and websites uh, that are used cross-platform on multiple devices so what is the best way to start well we're going to do that right now and i'm going to show you exactly how to create a web page first thing you're going to want to do is open up a text editor i'm going to be using notepad and we're going to start off by adding in tags tags are what define the website the look and the layout of the website so we're going to start off with an html tag we're going to go down two lines and we're going to close this tag off by adding a slash in there. Oh. And now what this means is whatever's in between these two tags, this basically means an HTML, the HTML code is starting and this is where the HTML code is ending. So everything we write in between is going to be displayed on the web page. All right, so now let's add a couple more tags here. So let's uh, tab over. We're going to add a head tag and just like we did with the HTML tag, we're going to close this one off. And we're also going to add a body tag and close this off as well. And let me, oh, not a question mark. Okay. So now with this, basically the head tag is basically used for things that for metadata, basically things you don't want to render out uh, on your web page. The body tags are what you want the web website to display. Um, and I'll show you a little bit of that in a little bit or in how it kind of works. But for now, we're going to go back up to the head tag. And we're going to also add a title tag. And we're going to close that off. We'll keep forgetting this forward slash. All right. So now in between here, we're going to add in, uh, let's just say E code. You can put, you know, your website's name or you can put your name and just say, you know, Mike's website or Haley's website. Um, so go ahead and do that. And we are going to save this file now. Save. I've already made a separate HTML folder. And what you're going to do is you're going to type in, let's just say I just typed in E code as my website and you're going to type in dot HTML. You got to save the file as dot HTML. Otherwise it won't display it in your browser. So hit E code or you know, whatever the title .html, hit save. All right, so now let's, let's take a look at what our web page looks like. So we're going to drag the .html file and drag it into a browser. And right now there's nothing in the body section, but if you look up top, you can see our title that we typed in. So now let's go ahead and add something to our body tags. Uh, let's go to the text editor again, and we're going to add a paragraph tag here and go ahead and close that off. And in between the paragraph tag, we're going to type in hello world, exclamation point. Oops. Welcome to my website. Can't type. And we're going to hit save. I hit control S. Minimize that. Now let's just drag it over. And just like that, there is simple text in our website. Now, just like we added simple text, we can change the background color. We can add images. We can add links. We can add a, a whole ton of things. So that will be for upcoming videos. And that's going to be all for this video. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys in the next one.